Hello students, in this video we are going to learn how to rationalize the denominator in these type of radical expressions. So before starting the solution, you must have a question why we rationalize the denominator. The purpose for which root rationalization is to remove the radicals in the denominator. In this type of expression, the rationalization factor or the factor by which we rationalize the denominator will be root 3 minus 2. So let's rationalize the denominator. So that's going to be 7 upon root 3 plus 2. Rationalize the expression. We multiply the and divide the expression with the rationalization factor. So that's going to be root 3 minus 2 divided by root 3 minus 2. So this is going to be 7 times root 3 minus 2 divided by let's multiply the two terms here we can make use of the identity a plus b times a minus b which equals a square minus b square so the numerator will be 7 square root of 3 minus 7 times 2 divided by this is going to be a square which is root 3 square minus b square which is 2 square. Here we are making use of the identity a plus b times a minus b equals a square minus b square. Solving it further this is going to be 7 root 3 minus 7 times 2 is 14 root 3 square is 3 minus 2 square is 4. So that's 7 root 3 minus 14 divided by 3 minus 4 is negative 1. As there is negative 1 in the denominator, let's take out negative sign common from the numerator. So that's going to be 14 minus 7 root 3 divided by negative 1. So this negative sign gets cancelled with the negative sign in the denominator. So we are left with 14 minus 7 root 3. So this is our final answer. And we see that there is no radical sign or there is no square root in the denominator of this answer. This is how we rationalize the denominator. I hope this video is helpful to you. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more math videos. Thanks for watching.